Tobago has the capacity to boost the economic development of Trinidad and Tobago with more capital investment and collaboration. This from Secretary of the Division of Health, Wellness and Social Protection in the Tobago House of Assembly, Dr. Faith B. Israel. Discussing the budget on the Now Morning Show, Dr. Israel illustrated how insufficient development funds can hinder Tobago's growth. You recognize that it means we could only buy a couple ambulances because we need to do everything else. We need to get the CT machines. We need to get the MRIs. We need to get everything else. In addition to the things that we need for public health, so we need to have our labs up and running. We need to ensure that we can treat with the dengue outbreak that's happening. All of those things are what is coming out of the $27 million for development that is allocated to the Division of Health, Wellness, and Social Protection. In addition to more capital investment, Dr. Israel recommends more collaboration between the government and the THA that allows the THA control of a funding to manage the island in ways more aligned with the needs of Tobagonians. When you look at the law, when you look at Schedule 5 of the Tobago House of Assembly Act, uh, items like the infrastructure relating to wharves and airports and so forth actually falls under the Tobago House of Assembly. So the appropriate action should really have been for the government to give the Tobago House of Assembly that funding and ensure that we work together to get it done on the island. Despite inherited debt and tight budgets, the Division of Health, Wellness and Social Protection is committed to meeting the goal of digitizing the public health care and social protection systems with the assistance of external partners.